Yo, trust me, do not skip this video. You clicked on this video for a reason, and now in today's video, I'm gonna be telling you guys all the tips and tricks you need to get better at NBA 2K20. Watch the whole video through. What's good with y'all boys, man? How y'all boys feeling today? Y'all boys, let me know how y'all feeling down in the comments today. Now, it's your boy right back with another video. Today's video, I'm gonna be telling all the come ups, all the beginners, everything you need to know of how to get better at the game. I see a lot of y'all in part um, struggling, so I hope this video help y'all out. Make sure y'all boys don't skip at all so y'all won't miss no important tips. And that's all I gotta say, really, make sure you don't skip. That's important. Don't skip, my guy. Now, for this first tip we're gonna get into, we're gonna go with build selection. Now, build selection, it's, it can get kind of tricky, you know? If you don't know what you like to do, I need y'all boys to figure that out right now. Like, think in your mind, what do you like to do? Do you like to shoot threes? Do you like to dunk the ball? Do you like to play defense? Or do you like to rebound? You know, it's a lot of builds out here. It can get real tricky. So, y'all boys find that out. And then once y'all find that out, y'all look up the build well any type of build of what you like to do in your search bar and i'm nine times out of ten you're gonna find a good build that can do with uh whatever you like to do because there's so many builds out here that's op it's crazy y'all boys can't be out here hooping with shooters and three-point specialists slashers and no bro y'all can't bro it's too many good builds you got two-way playmaking slashers there's too many demigod builds out here you know what i'm saying but anyways once you do make your build this other tip uh, make sure your build is able to speed boost because if your build is not able to speed boost then you're done for I'm gonna just tell you right now you're done for to be able to speed boost you need 86 plus ball handle so make sure y'all boys got that on y'all build if you're a point guard now if you're a center or some obviously you're not gonna be able to but anyways yeah make sure you boys have 86 plus now I can't stress this tip right here enough badges 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 grind the badges out in my career y'all boys need to grind the badges out in my career do not come to the park with no badges and expect to be dominant beating everybody no it's not happening everybody in this point of the game everybody has badges if you don't have badges go get them in my career don't come to park trying to get them you're gonna get dominated i'm sorry to be the one to tell you this but you're you're not gonna win much games and i've realized that playing a lot of you come ups um in the park so make sure y'all boys go to the my career four badges can't stress it enough now this next one we got jump shots i have a jump shot video on my channel i have a build video on my channel i'll leave all those video links down in the description make, make sure y'all boys check those out now for the jump shots, I just give y'all two good jump shots off the head right now. The best jump shots in the game, jump shot 98 or 38. Use those jump shots. Those are the best jump shots, I promise you. I would, I'm not telling no lies in this video. But anyways, do not come out here with your favorite player's jump shots. Do not come out here with LeBron James, Dwight Howard, whoever your favorite player is. Those jump shots suck, I promise you they suck go to the my career with 98 or 38 try it out you know grind your badges out with these jump shots and i promise you you will come out on top now all these tips i'm giving y'all y'all combine them all together i promise you you're gonna get better over time it might take some time but you will get better i promise you just give it a little bit of time y'all boys stick to it and practice and you'll give it some time also Another thing, y'all might see like players playing without their shot meters. Shot meters give you a boost if you time it right. But if you're a beginner and you just starting, do not turn your shot meter off. I advise you, please, 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 please don't. You need your shot meter if you're a beginner. Like, especially if you can't even time your jump shot with the meter on, do not turn it off. It gives you a boost, but at the same time, it hurts you if you don't time it right. So, Play with that shot meter on, practice it in the my career, go to the my court, shoot around with it, and you, you'll come out on top, bro, I promise you. 
just practice 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 now this next one um we're gonna go with boost boost as y'all can see i don't use boost um but if you're a come up i advise y'all to use boost i've been playing this game for over probably eight years honestly and i i'm just used to it so i don't use boost i don't need it but if you just now starting i advise y'all boys to put on boost so then you got hot zones hot zones they're very important that mixed together with a badge named hot zone hunter when you mix those two together it's op i promise you it's op make sure y'all boys get y'all hot zones right look up a video on youtube of how to get your hot zones and everything hot zones are really the most important thing in the game you know what i'm saying without them uh i'll probably be broke as y'all can see i don't have all mine i shoot nothing but threes so i don't care that's all i need is threes y'all see i got all my threes but yeah hot zones is very important if y'all need a badge layout video i got that i got a video on that too so just check out the description i'll link all those down now this next one we got my court practice 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 in the my court i cannot stress it y'all boys need to practice in the my court i have practiced over probably 30 hours in the my court over these past years my court bro it's really it's really op bro you need to practice in there like dribble moves animations that you just put on jump shots it helps for everything man my court is really good now if y'all boys don't have time for all these tips i'm sorry y'all just gonna be sorry forever now this next one i'll say i also say don't be scared to play comp but still choose your games wisely you know um if it's a legend on the spot I, I don't blame y'all for running not gonna lie but if y'all want that exposed video or that you know feeling if you beat them you know then y'all boys go for it but you still at the same time you still got to choose your games wisely y'all gonna get dropped off every time if y'all keep playing legends and stuff now for y'all little boys out there oh my god he's he's promoting running no i am not promoting running no i promise you i'm not i hate it i hate when dudes hop off when they see me i'm just a superstar three it's really irritating but at the same time i get where the come up's coming from because y'all boys gotta choose y'all games wisely y'all not that good at the game like other people have been, been playing it for years so i get both sides of it but at the same time don't be scared to lose games because those games you lose you can learn something from it like how next game you go against somebody like this you will guard them or what you would do better on offense even so make sure y'all boys don't be scared to comp but at the same time choose wisely now anyways i'm gonna wrap this video up right there if this video helped y'all boys in any way make sure y'all boys drop a like and a sub for me Tell me what y'all thought about the video overall down in the comments, and we out, bro. Peace.